I know we've been talking about fashion and how you came about, but outside of fashion, outside of you working, what kind of girl are you? What do you do? Are you playing around <laughs> in makeup? Are you travel? Are you a family type of girl? What type of girl is Lenore? Um, I spend a lot of time with my dog because okay. outside of like, again, working and working at home, poor thing, he's just like, watching me you know with his little <laughs> ball next to him hoping that like i'll stop and play with him and so i try to devote a lot of time to my dog when i can because i feel like you know he just gets neglected <laughs> because i'm so busy constantly and it's hard to like make time for everything i love my friends i love my family um so like i try to make time for everything and everyone but i also really appreciate my alone time you know when i do get a moment um I just, you know, like to relax. Sometimes I spend a little too much time on TikTok and, uh, but that's kind of like my time to like decompress from like everything. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I would say like, I, you know, I have a pretty um, social life and there's always like things going on, events, and I try to like support my friends and what they do. And so there's, mm -hmm. there's constantly like things happening. So there's never a dull moment. and. Yeah, like I said, when I do get a moment to just like relax and like read a book, uh, to me that's just like beautiful. <laughs> yeah, someone came up to me and was like, "You're really like reading a book," and I'm just like looking around like, "Yeah, what?" <laughs> They're like, "You look so young. I don't expect young people to read a book," and I'm just like, "What? What type of crazy?" That's what, yeah, that's <laughs> I'm. I've I'm always loved reading. reading. Yeah, since I was a kid, I used to read a lot. I think it was like a way for me to just, I, my imagination would just, you know, like go right. wild. And I just loved reading. Um, and now it's hard to find the time because at least when I lived in New York, I could like ride the, you know, the train and right. I would be like reading my book. And it was great. You know, I went like during my commute, if I had like an hour or, you know, even 30 minutes. But now I feel like I try to, you know, at least 10 minutes out of the day, like before mm -hmm. I go to bed, and I, I really need to be better about this, but like, instead of being on my phone, mm -hmm. pick up the book and like read a little bit. Um, I feel like it's, yeah, you, there's never, yeah, anything bad about even being able to just read for like a, a small moment of the day. And I'm trying to like program my brain to not be so like, okay, on social media, like scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. So mm -hmm. it's a good way to like slow down and just like, um, you know, keep my brain from getting fried. Yes. That social media will get you get you get you going, but yes. I've already detached myself. There's a fine I line up without a... <laughs> social media, so I'm just like, child, take this phone. Yes. I oh, you yes. just tell me what's going on. I can detach. That's craziness. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely, I agree. So.